Hello friends, in this video we will make a simple whiteboard animation. I will add the source files to the description section you can download them from there. If you like the video and subscribe to the channel, then let's move on to the video. Let's get started. First we import the illustrator file, while doing this, make sure that the create composition tick is active. We open the composition we created. There are empty layers left here, we delete them. Then we make the background color of the open composition white. Now we're importing our hand image. There are some problems here, the hand image is small. If we start animating like this, it's going to look bad, so we need to make the image a little bigger. Then we convert the illustrator file to shape and delete the illustrator file. Then we add a trim path to the converted file. We start the end value at zero. We go forward a few seconds and make the value 100. Let's watch it now. It looks good but it will be better. Now we activate the position of the hand layer. We move forward a few frames and place the pen tip where the line starts. And so we follow the line frame by frame. This part will take a little longer so I will speed it up. In the meantime don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like the video. Now we're done. Now we select all the keyframes and extend the distance between them a little bit. Let's watch. Very good. Now we will draw a line. This will extend from one picture to the next.
Then we will add a trim path to the line. We will start the end value at 0, move it forward a little and make the value 100. Then we will adjust the position of the hand layer according to this line. Then we activate the 3D feature of the layers and create a camera. We activate the camera's position. And make it follow its line. So the line will always remain in the middle of the composition. Now we will follow the line frame by frame as before and adjust the position of the hand layer to match the line.
Okay, now we're in the final steps. And we're going to select all the keyframes and make the distance between them a little bit longer. We're going to move the hand layer a little bit to the side. Let's watch. Very good. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for other videos.